what do you think were the biggest keys to the loss tonight? Um, you know, probably uh, we had we had some breakdowns offensively with uh, just a couple things, snaps, and um, you know some uh, miss uh, wrong direction stuff. And so we just got to you know uh, against a team like that, you can't do that. And uh, they kind of made us pay for it. And so we got to watch film. We got to get better. And that's what we got to do. We got to shrink our mistakes. I thought this was a game. Uh, probably out of the first three where we had the most mistakes and so uh, not the game to do that with a team like Rockford. So I, I would say, you know, Rockford made very little mistakes. You know, I don't remember them turning the ball over um, and, and then we had some breakdowns in, in the game. So we just got to limit our mistakes and try to shrink them and uh, uh, as we go into the OK Black. So, uh, you know, you guys had the turnover and then forced the three and out and they kick the field goal and miss, but then yeah, uh, you guys got the rough in the kicker. Penalty. Yeah, you know, you um, it, it for sure it was a huge momentum swing, but we we can't be in those situations, you know. Um, and, and obviously, we got to have some spatial awareness of where we are and understand. I mean, the kids are going hard trying to trying to block that kick and put us in a one possession game. But uh, we just got to, you know, like I said, we made a ton of mistakes. Um, we watch film, and hopefully, uh, this is the game where where we see where mistakes can hurt us, and we and we understand that and. Uh, yeah, we can go through the season, like I said, and shrink those mistakes. What's the biggest positive and biggest negative takeaway you can? Uh, the, you know, the negative would be our, our, our miscues. Uh, the positive is our kids are battlers. Uh, they fought to the end. They, uh, you know, they, they never thought they were out of the game. And I think that's all you can really ask of kids. You know, balls will be dropped and, and blocks will be missed and tackles will be missed and assignments will be blown. But if you can ask kids to give you effort and they give it to you, you know, effort's a decision. And, and those, those, those kids gave it all the time. So I'm, that's by far the positive is the way our kids uh, continue to battle and, and the effort they showed. And, you know, uh, what are your thoughts on Rockford this year? You know, what do you think they're going to accomplish through the rest well, of the Well, they're a good football team. You know, um, they proved that tonight. And, you know, they, they obviously they got a tough schedule with the OK Red, with the Granvilles and the East Kentwoods. And, um, and, and so I, I'm sure they'll have another, you know, they're 4-0, so they're two wins away from the playoff. And, you know, they want to be conference champs and make a deep run in the playoffs. So uh, they're a good football team. They're well coached. That coaching staff has done a great job. And, um, you know, I'm sure they'll have a great year after, after you know, this game.